For one thing, none of us know, know it all. And you should never say to your patient or talk on something that you don't know. Um, if a patient asks me something and I don't know something, I'll say, you know what, I'll find out and I'll get back to you. That expands our education too. And we are, we are lifelong learners. Regards to medications, sometimes that fear can stop us from providing the care that our patients need. If we're not familiar with a certain medication, if patients have moderate to severe atopic dermatitis, moderate to severe psoriasis, if they have hydronitis superativa, lots of times we need to move ahead. We move into advanced medicine. We can't hold that fear. We have to educate ourselves. We we have to go ahead and find those education materials. We have to connect with our MSLs. We have to find we have to find those answers and feel confident in what we're doing. And that's part of our responsibility to our patients. And a lot of, and in fact, when I was here at this meeting, I was talking with somebody that had been in practice for less than five years. And they said to me, they said, you know what? I was deathly afraid of taking care of psoriasis patients until I started education, educating myself on the medications. Then once I used them and realized that even what was written in the PIs and that, as long as it was the appropriate patient and the appropriate medication, I wasn't seeing these other things that I was so fearful of. And so it is really important if you don't educate yourself, if you don't treat the patient, you'll never gain that experience or gain that knowledge. You know, nothing's ever perfect. We're human beings. And, but we need to always strive to treat our patients.